Hi, it's Adrian. How are you today? And so I'm back. Um, I did go ahead and pick up a perfusion palette, and so I've been playing with it, and it's um, actually quite a lot of fun. So um, let's get started. And um, as far as my base today, I did go ahead and use the Elf Woglo as far as my primer goes. So this is the SPF with a little bit of glow to it. I also use the Undone Beauty, the Unfoundation Glow Tint. And um, I did go ahead and use a Pretty Fresh Concealer from ColourPop as well. As far as that went, I uh, did go ahead and use a bronzer, which is uh, the Sunrise from Flower Beauty, to go ahead and do this look. The blush is the Cute uh, palette. This is from Revolution, and this uh, line is actually over in Walmart now. And so I did actually... Whoa! Oh, I just stuck my fingernail in there. Um, I did go ahead and use the blush and the highlighter um, from this palette. And again, this is over at Walmart. Um, as far as what I used over the top, well, I used the highlighter from the blush. And then I also used this Natural Glow um, from Physicians Formula. Yeah, the name of it is Natural Glow. So I used that over um, the top of the blush, which is backwards. There we go. So I used these two as far as blush, and I did use the highlighter from the blush palette as well. Uh, let's see. I did go ahead and use the Sky High um, Mascara as far as uh, that goes, and the uh, Brow Glue and Taupe by NYX. And as far as the actual palette itself, the Profusion, um, this is their Metachrome palette. And uh, you can pick this up over at Walmart. Um, I, the smaller pans are going to be the matte pans, and then these larger pans are going to be the um, duochromes. And this is a pink, um, yeah, highlighting kind of powder. In fact, I'll go ahead and put a little bit of that right under here. There's not much room left here. <laughs> there we go. So that's what the pink powder in the middle does. And as far as my look, I went ahead and started with this color down here as far as my base. Um, I used this on the outer corner, this right in the middle of uh, the lid, and uh, then I used the white on the inner corner. <clears throat> and like you just saw, I put this one right under the brown bone. And then I did go ahead and pick these up. Um, this is called Portal, and it's um, it's a duochrome too. It comes in a different a different package, but it's part of the same line. I don't know if you can see that. I can't really tilt it because it's loose and it'll all fall out all over everywhere. Um, but I did go ahead and put that one on the brow bone as well. And I used the ColourPop Gel Eyeliner in Turquoise. This is how the look turned out. And I just think it's a lot of fun. Um, I'm glad that they came out with this. Uh, I've been wanting to try more of the duochromes. And just getting to play with the whole palette of them is a lot of fun. Like I said, um, this palette is just gorgeous. It has a lot of great combos in it. Can't wait to do something over here in the uh, warmer side of the palette. I just haven't gotten there yet. So um, this is my second look with this palette. Like I said, it's behaving really, um, it's just a really fun palette. I forgot a couple of things here. The Just a Tint, I have um, No Brainer on today. And this one's from ColourPop. Um, the Butter Glow, I went ahead and used the translucent one as an all-over sort of um, 
finishing powder. So that's the way that that one looks. And again, that's the finishing powder on here. And the other one, uh, the natural glow I used on top of, um, as a topper on top of the blush. And I think that's just about the whole thing. Um, actually, I forgot to put some glisten up here. Let's do that. Let's see if it makes this any more shiny. Hmm? Maybe a little bit. So if you don't want to wet your shadows and take the brush and wet them all afterwards, um, grab, you know, some sort of spray. You can even use water and just mist it and you won't get as intense of an effect, but you'll still get an effect. So let's see what it did here. That's the way to do it if you don't want to, you know, sit there with the brush forever. Um, but I think that's the end of the video. And thank you and have a great day. Bye.